What's up guys? So back with another video today. Today's a big day for Google Pixel and Google Pixel XL. We finally get a, a custom recovery. And guess what? It's twerp. We all love twerp. Destroy has dropped us an alpha. I'm going to link everything down below for both the Pixel XL and the Google Pixel. It's been said that if you want root, it's currently, if you do flash this, you're going to lose root. So that's number one. Chainfire needs to hook up a new systemless way because this patches both, both boots and it won't work. So you're basically just going to get recovery out of this. Um, it might wipe data. So if you have anything important, back it up somehow. You know, he even says the restore might not work. If you're using multiple accounts on the phone, do not install it. Because again, it won't work. If you're a single user, this should be fine. Um, he also made some references about a phone call and maybe something about Google Photos. I think that was a joke, but we're here to find out. This is the, this is the page where you would download and get the instructions. Again, I'm going to link that all down below. Well, let's jump right into this. I'm going to do my best to go into the screen. I'm going to zoom to give you guys the best possible way that I can do this. But yeah, so there you go. So you're going to download these two files. There's a zip and there's an image. You're going to need Fastboot. And I think you're going to need ADB, I think, because there's two files. There's an image, the IMG file, you're going to boot to the phone, and then the zip file you're going to install once the phone reboots. We're going to go through with this in a minute. Just wanted to make sure. They're not responsible for anything that happens here. If you wind up screwing up your boot, you have to download um, either a custom kernel for your phone or download you know, the original stock Android one for it and just flash it over and you'll be back. You're not going to brick anything. Don't worry about it. All right, so let's get on. Let's get on with this video. Let's turn the volume off so we're not getting beeps. All right, so we're going to be doing this on a MacBook, just because that's all I have. I don't use Windows. It's no hate, but so we're going to go into my Downloads folder, and we're going to do ADB reboot boot loader. Which brings my phone, let me bring it a little bit closer to the, brings my phone here to boot on about. Let's make this a little bit bigger so you guys can see. All right. Now we're going to do fast boot, fast boot, boot, and then we're going to go back to the screen. Uh, twerp image, the name of the file was twerp uh, 3.02 fast boot marlin all right so twerp 3.02 alpha fast boot marlin remember fast boot and then boot if you flash it you're gonna soft brick your phone you're not gonna brick it you're gonna soft brick it okay so we're going to do it here we go one two three Boom. Downloading boot. Booting. And look at that. We got team win recovery. Booting. How cool is this? Now it's asking you for your password. Your password is going to be your pin that you have on your phone. I'm going to type it off camera for a minute. You guys... Talk amongst yourselves for a minute. All right, here we go. She's going. Swipe to allow modifications. And then there you go. Now, according to the instructions, we're going to go to install and this is why I was saying 
we might need ADB. It seems like we do. Unless, let's see. I'm going to play around with it. No, I'm not going to give the benefit of the doubt. All right. I think I'm going to need ADB. All right. So we're going to go back to the computer. Let's move this over here. You're going to do ADB push. Um, let's see. Twerp pixel installer Marlin. Marlin is the XL, remember. And you're going to use the other one for the regular pixel. You're going to push that to SD card. Okay, successfully pushed. Now we're going to go back over to the phone. I'm going to click install, and there it is. Now let's make sure installing zip. Okay, all set. Flash. Twerp installer for Pixel. Boom, 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 boom. Updating partition table, done. All right, let's reboot the sucker. All right, I'm gonna pause this, that way you guys don't have to watch me boot. All right, guys, so we're back. And we didn't lose any data. What kind of luck is that? All right, so now let's see if it works. I'm gonna go back to the computer just for the fun of it since I don't know the, the button combination. Maybe you guys can drop it down in the comments how to get into recovery. I'm, I'm too lazy. So ADB, reboot, recovery. Wait for it, wait for it. Wait for it. Wanna see that Team Win logo? <gasps> Showing the Google. <gasps> Team win. Look at that. We got recovery. How cool is that? Again, you know, it's going to ask you for your password. I'm going to type that off camera. Always remember it's going to ask you for your password. Now, I honestly don't know what happens. And if you type the password, you're going to press the little button there. Now, I'm not sure what happens if you type in the wrong password. It might erase your data. But there you go. We officially have Twerp, and it works. Click the reboot button. Go back to system. And there you go. That's it. How to have Twerp working on your Pixel or Pixel XL. Again, I will have all links down below where to install and everything else, what you need. The only thing I can't really show you is how you do this on Windows, but I assume if you own a Pixel, you're going to know how to do this anyway. All right, guys, if you like this video, there, goes the, there it goes. Thank God for the Rhino Shield. No problem. All right, guys, if you like this video, please drop it a thumbs up. It helps me a lot. I'm trying to grow this channel and do my best. Just keep, just keep slamming that like button and leave your comments down below. I'm still doing the Get Rhino Shield case bumper giveaway. All right, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. All right, guys. See you in the next one. Laters.